Hey everybody. Well, today is a special day and I'm so excited. We are headed out west, but first, something more important is taking place. Well, Mrs. Phillips, 33 years of teaching over. Yep, retired life, let's go. We're headed today. We are going to Utah, Colorado, and Arizona, and get some national parks, and just try to relax. I even brought a book. I know many of you are shocked, because I don't like to really read a lot. What, a I, teacher that doesn't like to read? Oh, I like to read children's books, but. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully, we will have a very uneventful trip out, no bad weather, no, I'm not even gonna say anything else that could go wrong. Hopefully the traffic won't be bad and the roads will not shake us out of here, so. Today's destination, Oklahoma City. I think we're gonna spend the night at a Cabela's. Sounds good to me, if let's not, go. I guess it'll be Cracker Barrel, so. <laughs> the old standby. Yep. driving for a long time. Almost there. I don't know how much longer. Why? My waves went off. So there we go. Two hours. Two hours still. We'll get there. going to take us to get there because apparently it's a really bumpy highway and his foot keeps slipping off the gas pedal. Only in Oklahoma I guess you gotta act like you're at the rodeo. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I just dropped the camera. <laughs>
cold place. We're here for breakfast. My morning cup. We're gonna see what else they have. This place is called Hatch. Well, that was good. Yes, it was. It was yummy. I'm very full now. Now I get to go sit in the car again for 10 more hours. That was the Hatch restaurant. We're here in North Oklahoma City this morning and we're headed to Albuquerque. Probably gonna do a harvest host tonight. But oh, I'm stuffed. That was a great breakfast. Yep, it was yummy. A little loud. I would have liked to have filmed inside, but it was a really cool uh, little brunch place. But don't worry, y'all. I got you. I got you. I, I filmed a little bit, but you'll have to do voiceover because it was just kind of a little loud. So, so anyway, it is pretty cool. We are headed to Oklahoma City. Day two of our summer 2024. What would you call the Southwest trip? Yeah. So. So we parked over here in a Cabela's so that we wouldn't take up all their parking. And I had no idea that nobody's actually out here this early in the morning. So yeah, it's Memorial Day, so it's kind of quiet this morning, which is nice. Not a lot of traffic, but we're getting ready to get on the road and we'll see you when we get to our harvest host. Well, this is interesting. We just finished breakfast. I am stuffed. That was a really good breakfast. And Michelle pops on me. Oh, I think we're going to the Harvest Host. And Michelle says, no, we don't need to put in Harvest Host yet because we have to stop in Amarillo for lunch. Why are we stopping in Amarillo? Where are we headed? It's called the Big Texan Steak Ranch. Big Texan Steak Apparently Ranch. Apparently it's a famous steakhouse. And they have like this... huge steak i don't know it's like 70 something ounce steak we'll find we'll let you know the exact you're gonna eat 72 get, ounce steak no i don't eat that much steak all year but <laughs> what we're gonna but they apparently you get it free if you eat it all within like an hour and, free. and the sides we're not gonna get that we're just going for the experience no. um because i've seen a lot of other people and they all say that it looks really it's a great little place to go so we should get there right about lunchtime so that'll be a perfect stop now let's just cross our fingers that we can get in because ain't nobody got time to wait for an hour for a table. So we'll see. So I guess we'll see you in Amarillo. Come along. It smells like cows there. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you think that we are in Amarillo. You would be wrong because, well, little secret about Michelle, my wife is a Chick-fil-A sweet tea fiend. I think she's addicted. But before we can go anywhere and get on the road good, we have to stop and get a sweet tea. Now I know I have my coffee and I keep my coffee going all day long. So I don't really have room to talk, but I don't know if we're ever going to get to Amarillo if we have to stop anymore. Anyway, back to our trip. I'm set for the day. Yep. <laughs> Look at that. Big as my head. So. You got a big head, all right. Yeah. 
<laughs> so we're good. All right. I have to have my sweet tea. All right, good deal. Time to go. The Big Texan has served cowpokes and the like since 1960. It is a Route 66 icon and home of the 72 ounce steak challenge. See rules at BigTexan.com, but in the short of it, you have one hour to finish the 72 ounce steak and all of the sides to get your meal free. Otherwise, pay up, partner. This poor feller tried, but no go. Park? Yeah, Birdie, yeah. Birdie are super clean, yeah. new. Outside of Albuquerque. Just outside of Albuquerque off of 40. Yep, literally maybe a half a mile off 40. So. That was our spot, right? There. Great pulling spot. Number 10. Yep, looks so pretty. Very secure, There's cameras everywhere. We felt very safe here. That's good. Bye, Bye Birdie. Well, that was a good night's sleep. Yes, it was. I like that RV park. It was pretty. I liked it. Yeah, nothing. It was quiet and safe. Very safe. I felt safe. So now we're on 40 West and we are headed to Dark Sky RV Park in Kanab. Tomorrow we're going to do a hike, the, the Antelope Canyons hike. And Horseshoe Bend. And Horseshoe Bend. So I'll spend a couple of days in that area. So we're really looking forward to doing some hikes there. And I'm hoping we're staying at a Dark Sky RV park. I think it's uh, like right on the edge of a mesa. And uh, I think we'll be able to get some really, really cool shots of the uh, night sky. And I'm tired. <laughs> yeah. But however, we did get a good night's sleep, but we're still tired. <laughs> so we just we just stopped and picked up a few items. Now we're heading a little bit further west and then we cut off and go out in the middle of no man's land. So I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty hot out here in the desert. And it's only May. But it's clear skies. <laughs> there we go. Sorry, gotta love the camera. Ryan. But it's clear skies, and um, so we're looking forward to this next part of our adventure. This shall be fun. All right, we will see you in Canab. Honey, give me your impression of the roads in New Mexico. Here, I'll pull over here. This is what it... <laughs> oh, 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 this is the trucker lane. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. These roads in New Mexico are terrible. I'm sorry, I'm having nightmares about... Oh, 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 oh. I can't even sleep all the way through the night. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> This is all we do. It's literally, it's such a pain. It's very yeah. beautiful, but I have one complaint, New Mexico. Get your roads right. Yes, please. 40. <laughs> I 40. 
I-40. There's a lot to be desired, so. Spend a little money on I-40, please. Well, on our way to Kanab, and we just got to Gallup, but we had to try Dave's, what's it called? No, Blake's. Oh, Blake's. Blake's Blake. Lotta Burgers. I guess it's a staple for New Mexico for fast food burgers. Um, but uh, anyway, onion I, rings just, are good. I just got onion rings and a, and a lot of burger. So their tagline is best burger under the sun. Leaving Gallup, our travel turned northwestward through Navajo land. The Navajo Nation extends into Utah, Arizona, and New Mexico, covering 27,000 square miles of diverse sandstone, red rock, and desert vistas. Navajo land is larger than 10 of the 50 states in America. The next few days, Michelle and I would enjoy the diversity and beauty that is Dene Keya. my view. Here's my little shaded thing. I have patio chairs, a table, I have a gas fire pit, and a hammock. This is my view. Join us next week as we explore Antelope Canyon X and Horseshoe Bend. Who knows, there may even be a giant chicken involved. Oh, and don't forget, hit that like and subscribe button. We are happy you are here. Thanks. Be safe. Happy trails.